Hi, I'm Nick Ray from Fandroid, and in this video I'm going to show you how to create scrolling screenshots on pretty much any Android device. Capturing a screenshot on an Android phone or tablet is pretty simple. On the HTC 10 here, you can do it by pressing the power and volume keys at the same time. The screenshot is automatically saved to your phone's gallery and can be shared with just a few taps. However, things can get a bit complicated when capturing a screenshot that's longer than the phone's display. This could include a website, a Hangouts or SMS conversation, or even your app drawer. There are a handful of Android devices which have a scrolling screenshot feature built right in, but with an app called Stitch and Share, you can easily emulate the same feature. Once the app is installed from Google Play, you can go about capturing screenshots as you typically would. If you want to capture a scrolling screenshot, Capture the first one and then scroll down a bit, leaving a little of the content visible from the first screenshot in the frame, and then capture your second screenshot. You can repeat the second step as many times as necessary to capture everything you need for the screenshot you want. When you're done, tap the stitch and share notification, and you'll see the screenshots you captured all stitched together. If something is a little off, you can tap the scissors icon where the images are stitched and manually adjust the overlap between the images. You also get basic editing features which allow you to add a black line over text or highlight something using various colors. The free version of the app only allows you to highlight things in yellow, but if you're willing to pay at least 99 cents, you get a dozen or so additional colors. Paying for the app also removes all the ads and the watermark which shows up automatically in the bottom right hand corner of all the screenshots. If you use another app for scrolling screenshots or have a suggestion on how to do it another way, feel free to share it in the comments below. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to give the video a thumbs up.